What's going on guys? Today we're going to be reacting to this YouTuber. I do not know what his name is. Kodak WK. So let's just watch it. Screwed up very, very badly. There's a lot I can talk about within this video, but today I'm just going to keep it kind of short and simple. And I'm going to talk about only a couple things that Fortnite messed up with, in my opinion. So you guys know the glider redeploy update. We were playing the game normally... Guys, redeploy is not out anymore. Just saying. Yeah, this video is kind of old. Without this update, they go ahead and bring it straight in. It was very weird. You used to not be able to pull out your glider after you jumped off of something. But whenever they released this update, it seemingly changed the whole feel of the game. Now, this was a great update in a... Not for me, it didn't. It made it really fun to me. This guy's just kind of toxic. Bad update. And both of these different sides of the update had their own reasons. I mean, on the good side, it was great because you could build battle people. And then if you got shot down, it wouldn't matter because you could just fly away. It made the game super fun because, like I said, it brought building back into the mix. It made it feel like season two just with you pulling your glider everywhere. But a bad thing was, you know, it was kind of hard to kill people because if you did shoot at them, they probably were just going to run away and fly away. I mean, before they would have to have a launch pad if they wanted to get away quicker or some bouncer. But now they could just build two ramps up and fly away from Okay, look at this Did you like glider boy? Of course. No 15% of people did not like it This game these people are crazy and it seemed like everyone was in the air. I mean, you would look up and there would be three ramps in the sky everywhere. So what's the problem with this? Why am I saying... There isn't any problem. You're target. ...saying that Fortnite screwed up. Why am I saying that Fortnite messed up badly? But we're going to get into that in today's video. Now, I know I seem crazy. Wait, hold up, guys. Let me go back. Everywhere. So what's the problem with this? Why am I saying that Fortnite screwed up? Why am I saying that Fortnite messed up? Look at his AR. And look at the AR on the ground. This guy. Dude. Badly. But we're going to get into that in today's video. Now, I know I seem crazy. I know most of the stuff I've been talking about so far doesn't really make it seem like they messed up. But I promise when you get to the end of the video, I'll explain everything pretty well. Now, let's talk about their recent updates to the end of the video. And he's telling other people off for clickbaiting. Wow. The game. It seems like they've been changing a lot of things. I mean, they're trying to cater to a lot more players. They've seen plenty of players, you know, leave the scene. There's been countless competitive players who have stopped playing Fortnite or just said Fortnite doesn't really feel the same. It doesn't feel as fun. They obviously didn't really like that. So they started adding in more and more and more updates. So about, you know, a month ago, this was a state of the game. People were starting to get bored. And I know if you weren't starting get bored don't let this apply to you but you know most people were starting to get bored it was the same thing you know you were just run who was bored though who was bored this kid like i just don't know around play the game shoot people and try to win they kept on continuously adding in new items and then out of nowhere they introduced glider redeploy now we saw glider redeploy i think it was called like high flying 50s or something along those lines it was basically 50 versus 50 but you could pull out your glider and i wasn't too big of a fan of it because it was a stray away from the natural game and we'll get to that later make sure you remember that it doesn't feel the same that's gonna apply later Later in this video so like I said it didn't feel the same playing Fortnite for around you know a whole year without being able to pull out your glider and then just hopping into a game and being able to do that was stupid to me so I continued to play the regular 50 you're stupid like it literally it, it could save your life dude like if you're like in a bill battle some kid knocks you down that has like two kills and you have like ten dude like seriously it just didn't feel up to me. Versus 50 and all of... 
Well, most of the community didn't think much of this. We thought this was just going to be like the shooting test. They were going to add it into a couple of game modes. It just didn't feel right to me. See what's up. But it seems like they had it in the high flying 50s for like a week and then they seemingly just added it straight into the game. Now, the community did not like it at first because, like I said, it felt unnatural from the natural game. Being able to, being able to pull out your glider was so weird, and them just upright adding it into the game was really weird for some of the players who played every single day. Now, I know, like, Ninja and Myth and all them who stream daily and play the game every single day were so shocked by this change because they've been playing the game every single day and then this just changes the whole meta seven minutes ago epic made a post in a tweet and said that they're uh the glider redeploying mm. is staying yeah i thought it would only be in for like a little bit because of the zombies right because the zombies always break your stuff down it would be super annoying if you didn't have glider redeploy and they would just kill you all the time I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that. I don't know how I feel about that either. Thank you guys all for the Twitch Prime subs. So appreciate team, it, man. After team, after team, after team. Welcome to the Ninjas. Galactic Jack, sing with the 500 bits. Ninja, I think personally. He's still popular, but like. The, 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 the deploying, the constant deploying of the glider is just complete trash for squads. Headshot in 150. That lucky trap kill that I just get it. I mean, like. Weeks ago. Case in point, we just got a lobby of players. Okay, guys, I cannot do this anymore. I'm just going to skip the video. Now, Glider Redeploy is still in Playground, Soaring 50s, Disco Domination, and etc. And they might bring it back in the future, but I'm just left to think to myself, why would they add it in and then take it out? They should have asked the community how they felt before they added it in. And if people said they liked it, they would release it and keep it in the game. If they said they didn't like it, they shouldn't have put it in the game in the first place. I don't know why they put it in the main game if people were just going to complain about it. Fortnite just screwed up. I don't even want to play the game anymore because Glider Redeploy was so much of my gameplay. It was an important mechanic that I like to use very, very frequently. If you've watched any of my other videos, I've had gameplay in them and I was constantly flying around. Now you can barely fly around. I barely even want to play the game anymore. That's really how for- Okay guys, this is really over dramatic. I barely want to play anymore. Why are you even making the video then? Jeez. I just screwed up very, very badly. What are your thoughts on Glider Redeploy? Do you think they never should have released- My opinion is that they should bring back Glider Redeploy, keep it in the game forever. That's my, that's my thoughts. Released it. Do you think they should have kept it in, or do you think it was good that they released it and tested and then took it out? I hope you guys have some sort of the same feel as I do, just because I- Okay, guys. Well. Just, just, wow, though, like. It's kind of weird. Cringy. So, guys, this is going to be in the video. My opinion, this guy's not bad. He does clickbait. Not clickbait, sorry. Uh, he is, he's over dramatic. And he's just not saying he's bad. Just saying he's like a little bit over dramatic and stuff. So, guys, hopefully you like this video. Subscribe and like if you're new. Turn on post notifications if you can. And then I'll see you next one, boys. Bye. Two, one, drop it.